In today's video, I'm going to show you how to link Google Slides. I know there are a lot of questions about um, when you have several slides and you click a um, button or an image on one slide and it automatically takes you to another slide. So in this video, I will show you how to do that. Before we get started, be sure to um, like and subscribe at the bottom of my page if you um, like the video. Also, click the notification bell so that you can get a notification for upcoming videos that I post to my channel. Okay, so to show you how to um, link your slide to another slide, I am first going to show you what I am talking about or what your um, intentions probably are when you um, are trying to link your slides. So I'm going to put it in present mode and kind of show you what I already created. Um, and then I'm going to actually show you what to do. So in present mode, my first screen says matching the correct sentence. So when I click down here where it says click here to begin, my slide is automatically going to go to the next slide or my thing is going to automatically go to the next slide. And then when I get to this slide, it says which picture matches the sentence. And it says my ladybug has six black dots. So if I was presenting this to my students, they would read the sentence and then they would click on one of these images. Well, this image right here is going to if it's, it's incorrect so i have it linked to where it is going to make a sound telling them or showing them that it's incorrect and then when they click the correct one it will automatically shift them to the next slide so just say if i'm making a mistake and i click this one then it makes that and i have a separate tutorial that i will be doing on how i got that image to make that sound when i clicked on it and then when I click that, that is what it does. Okay, so to do that, I'm going to go down here. I've already, I already have um, two slides that I'm going to work with to show you since they have that. But what I did was I, um, first to get my images, I clicked on insert images and then I searched the web. And when I got to that, I just typed in ladybug cartoon and I had all these different types of ladybugs come up. And then I just picked two of the images that I wanted to add to my slide. So to, um, since this is a slide that has that animated sound, meaning that it's correct, incorrect, this is the one that is correct, which I want to link it to the next slide. So when the students click on it, it will go to that slide. So to do that, I would click over the image itself and you can either click command K or you can click insert and go down to link. So I'm going to click command K and then this second little screen pops up. Well, right here it says slides in this presentation. I'm going to click on that and then all my other options are going to come up. Well, in this case, I want it to link to slide seven because I want it to go to the next one. So then I would click slide seven and click apply. So then now you see it says slide seven. It automatically when you click or when it's in present mode, it will automatically go to that next slide. So then I'm going to go to my next slide because when my students are done, I want them to automatically go back to the, the beginning um, or the first slide. So in this case, I want it to say return to the beginning. So I'm going to insert a text box and go ahead and write that or type that. So return to first slide. I'm going to change the color on it. And the font, I love Luckiest Guy. It's like my favorite, one of my favorite fonts. Okay. And then while I have it highlighted, I am going to do Command K. And then I, in this case, want it to link back to the first slide. And then I'm going to apply it. So then when they click on it, it should link back and it changed the color but I can just change it back 
click on that and delete that. I don't know why it did that. I, it did it before and I just kind of changed the color on it. So you can just change the color um, to your liking. So then when I click on it now, it um, it should take the students or whomever back to the first slide. So I'm going to click on this one and then I'm going to go to present mode just to make sure um, or show you exactly what it'll do. Okay, so if I was wrong, it would do that. And then when I click here, it should take me back to my first slide. And that is how you um, link your slide.